Many of us take dining out for granted, but for some, it never happens. But now a new tradition is giving is changing that. Eyewitness News reporter Walt Buteau has more in this week's Street Story. You probably wouldn't notice anything different about this Cranston Cafe until we told you. How is everything, you guys? The developmentally disabled staff members train at the Characters Cafe to work their way towards jobs in other restaurants. How is everything, you girls? It's very good. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Also have counselors with disabilities. Gateways to Change runs a similar program that puts clients in classrooms. The children learn to see people with disabilities as people that you look up to. How is everything, Tom? Good. They see that person as a teacher, which is a wonderful thing. Hey! Omelette special! It was a perfect fit when the cafe decided to reach out into the cold streets. When the homeless eat out, they eat outside. But about once a month, they are welcome here with menus, professional waiters, and no tab. For a few hours, we were able to restore some pride and dignity into them that they hadn't felt in a long time. In a different room, barbers provide haircuts. On a table, there's clothing. McGilvery learned a few things about how tight this community is. And I said to the man, I said, would you like some socks? And he said to me, I already took a pair, leave that for somebody else. So the care that they had for each other was really a beautiful thing to see. It is one night of dignity with a side order of the ideal that this will lead to much more. How do we get them to be members of society? Maybe we can open up the door to going and having the courage to fill out the job application or having the courage to how do we acclimate you back into society. Monday is the next Dining with Dignity. You can find out more about that and about the cafe on WPRI.com. In Cranston, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.